So people, this is uh, my bell pepper garden, my bell pepper spot, where I uh, have nothing but uh, bell peppers. And I've got uh, jalapeno peppers. I've got one spot just for my peppers. Just for my peppers. These are my jalapenos over here. I've got quite a few of them. I know you're wondering what am I going to do with all of this pepper. And part of this stuff I don't even eat myself. But uh, Fran have use for it. Fran like bell pepper. She likes stuffed peppers. And uh, we got a 90 year old cousin that likes this stuff. And uh, we got other family and relatives that like bell peppers. So, actually, I plant this stuff because I just like to see it grow. And these starter, start plants that I have here, they're already looking right pretty. I turned the camera back on so you could hear that bird singing, but it seemed like he stopped. As soon as I got the camera on, he acted like he was singing, hurry up and get it out there so he could do some eat on. Now these are my tomatoes. I've already got those out and I'm getting ready to put up some cattle panel to cover them. Oh my chair that I sit on out here in the garden have blown over. I don't think that it fell on one of my plants. No, it didn't fall on the plant, but uh, it's got to be turned around. We can't have this fighting the critters and the chairs. Can't have that. But anyway, people, these are the tomato plants. And I've got about, uh, I don't know, maybe about 20, 25 of these. But I've got uh, different varieties. But you know, I mainly got those beef steaks, those beef masses. Because when I eat a made a sandwich, yeah, I said made a made a sandwich, sandwich, I like to have one big slice of made a. So we still out here in the garden. It's April 19th, and uh, we still dropping seeds, setting out plants, and other little bit of stuff. I found me a secret, people. Uh, I didn't really find it, but Fran sort of stumbled up on it for me. I'm going to show you what it is. Because, you know, I've been fighting with the deer for some time now. And uh, this windmill here that Fran found, uh, Fran had, she got several of them up there around the house. But uh, it spins, it makes a noise when the wind is blowing. So it makes the critters think that there's somebody out here and it, there's somebody making a sound. So it, it sort of keeps them away. I haven't had any problems since I put it out here because I put those... Uh, cabbages and those greens out earlier and I even left my gate open one night came out here about 11 30 at night just to shut it up and uh, I didn't the next morning I didn't have any type of damage done to my garden so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna try to put out some more of those bunch beans like I did last year the one they ate the top off of I'm gonna try that this year and see if this thing will work if it do then I'm gonna buy seven eight of them. Okay, people, don't go anywhere. While I go, I said don't go nowhere, and that's what I mean. Be right back. 